Today on our 2013 Volkswagen Jetta, we're doing a test fit of the Rhino Rack Vortex Aero Crossbars. The part number for our crossbars today is RRVA118B-2. For our foot pack, we're using RRRLKVA. And the fit kit for the Volkswagen, we're using DK306. Now we already have our front bar on and loaded up. We're going to show you how we put the last foot pack together and then we'll show you how we load up the back crossbar. So the first thing we'll do is take this bolt here on our foot pack and loosen that up. We'll then place on our clamp and we'll tighten that bolt back down just enough so that it holds the clamp in place and that it's not going to fall off. And then we can flip the foot pack over. We're going to pull off this plastic piece on the bottom and we'll take our rubber foot and we're just going to close all the seams on here. Now in the instructions it'll go into more detail but they want both of the arrows on the rubber piece and on the plastic piece of the foot to face out whenever you have it on your foot pack. So we're going to face it to towards the clamp right there. Now we can take our foot pack and we'll fit that onto our crossbars. We're just going to line up that nut and slide it in. And then our measurement for the inside strip here is going to be 18 centimeters. So we'll mark that and adjust our foot back. We'll then take our tool and tighten down this bolt here at the bottom. Double check this before we load it up on our car. Perfect. Now we can open up our vehicle doors and we'll load up our crossbar. We're going to take the crossbar. And the side that I did is going to be on the passenger side. Again, that'll go into more detail in the instructions about how to know which foot pack goes to each side. I'll just readjust those. So the clamps are going to sit right up under here. They won't be tight yet until we start tightening down that bolt. And your foot packs should sit with that rubber piece right up against that edge there. Now we can take our flat tape and we're going to measure from the center of the front foot pack to the center of the back. And we're going to have 70 centimeters between the two. Now if you ever have your clamp gets stuck like that, you can just lift it up and it will readjust there. So from the center of the front to the center of the back, and with that side even, we'll check the other side. Now a good thing to remember is that anything you do to one side, you want to do to the other. So we'll measure one side and we want to make sure the other side is even as well. Double check that our foot pack's sitting right and then we can start tightening that down. Now how I like to start tightening it down is 
I'll tighten the clamp all the way up against the door frame like this. And then I'll go back and forth doing about five to 10 turns on each side until it's completely tight and secure on my vehicle. Now doing it back and forth like this is again just going to keep it even and make sure that we're tightening it down the right way. It's also going to prevent our crossbars from pulling to one side or the other. So if I tighten this side down too much, it's gonna pull that foot pack this way and it's gonna completely mess up our crossbar and you won't be able to use it or put any of your accessories on there. So we want that to be extremely tight, but not too tight so that it damages your vehicle. We just want it tight enough that if we mount any accessories on there, they're not going to fly up or fall off or sit lopsided on your vehicle. And then with both of those sides tight, I'll take my end cap for my crossbars on this side. I'm just going to fit that in there. And then we also have a tool that comes with it. And that's just gonna lock up that end cap and keep anything on your roof rack system secure. So if you have any T-Track mounted accessories, you're not gonna have any problem with theft or tampering because that is going to secure them on there. And then we'll take our end cap cover, or our foot pack cover and Secure that down and in place, and that's going to secure your crossbars to your vehicle. And that's going to complete our look at the Rhino Rack Vortex Aero crossbars and how they fit on our 2013 Volkswagen Jetta.